Jordan is located in the heart of the Arab world. It is famous for Petra, an archaeological city cradle of sandstone rock built by nomadic Arabs called Nabataeans. Their descendants, Bedouins, continue living among the tombs and caves. One of Bedouins climbed to the top of the monastery while others were chilling on rocks with the music on. The monastery is the farthest monument from the entrance, which means that you have to take a long hike, including 900 rough steps, but it is definitely worth hiking. Through the Sea Canyon, you will get to the popular treasury which appeared in Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. No surprise that Petra is included in the UNESCO World Heritage Site and one of the new seven wonders of the world. In an inhospitable landscape, ancient civilization Nabataeans built a luxurious and extraordinary city. Petra was the capital of a powerful trading empire. Nabataeans were extremely skilled traders, builders, carvers, and water engineers. The city had a water channel system that was constructed to offer water for its 30,000 citizens. It was destroyed by a massive earthquake. Approximately only 15% of Petra has been explored by archaeologists. The lost city has still plenty of secrets to be revealed. The room, also called the Mars on Earth, is a breathtaking red sand desert with messy rock formations. Its landscape is very similar to Mars. It feels so much like another planet that is mostly used as the backdrop to Hollywood science fiction movies. To name just a few, Star Wars Rise of Skywalker, Dune and Lawrence of Arabia. There are small herds of camels that roam in the desert and occasionally come to drink water at Lawrence's spring.
many Bedouins. We explored the desert with one of them. While showing us better this from the stone edge, he was climbing and jumping from one high rock to another. We moved around through the dunes and valleys of Wadi Rum's landscape by his old pickup truck. running from the north to the south of Jordan. It belongs to the world's most beautiful roads. On the way there are stunning views among the massive rock formations and mountain scenery of Wadi Mujib. At Mujib Panorama Bedouins offer tea and handmade rugs made from naturally dyed sheep and camel wool. According to biblical tradition, Mount Nebo is connected to the memory of the place where Prophet Moses died after having seen the Promised Land. This site provides a unique view over the Holy Land. On very clear days you can see Bethlehem, Jerusalem, the oasis of Jericho and the Dead Sea. Due to its high concentration of salt, you are unable to sink in it. Its mud is rich for minerals and it is the best natural spa treatment ever. Jordan is full of mysteries and has so much to offer for the curious traveler. 